All right, it's that time once again for another Alterac Valley, November 11th, 2023. Looks like we got 17 Maniacs up in the house. I shot the sheriff is the lead for this one here. Let's see what we can get done. Probably going to IBT choke, right? Don't forget to hit that like, share, subscribe, and notification bell. Lions got five healers. We have six, so we should be a little bit on the same playing field here. Taking out some targets from up here. Gotta love that. Just watch out for the Death Knight so you don't get gripped down. That's a free killing blow. I'll take that. Warrior tanks rushing in. They have enough tanks here where they can just do a boss rush. They have four tanks for sure. They could just go all south, burn the two in the base or not, and just pull, you know. With that many tanks for sure. Paladin is up in here. Blinded everybody. Waiting for that bop. Pops his cooldown. There's bop. Immune for a few seconds here. Try to line of sight and run out, but be careful. You don't want to get knocked. You don't want to get knocked. The name of the game, right? Now we can take out the Paladin. He's got no bubble. He's on for Barrett's for a little bit too. Just need massive amounts of damage. Go. There it is. I'll take that killing blow. Warrior tank is up in our face. Is he the only one in here right now? Up oh, there's a healer now. The chamois healer is up in the house. Yep, where'd they go? That's what sucks about fighting in our towers, man. <laughs> Everyone's like, well, your towers are a lot better because you can, like, knock people out a lot easier. Problem is, though, if you're inside the tower, you can't really see what the hell's going on. Booty Mist is one of their healers here. Trying to put some damage on them. They're going to try and run out of LOS. Rolling away. I'm over here. I don't want to interrupt Vivify. Vivify doesn't seem like it's that big of a heal. Try to interrupt, you know, Soothing Mist instead, right? Get this healer down at the bottom of the tower. They're running away now. Man, they survived. And we got the Rogue on me too. Cheap shot. I'm going to go ahead and trinket that. Drop some traps down too. And Turtle. Run back up the ramp. Keep going up the ramp. I got Explosive Trap as well. So I can put one down up here at the top. If anybody gets up here, they're going to get knocked down. They got a tap on our Relief Hut. We have a tap on Stonehearth Graveyard. Looks like we got some people that are trying to get Stonehearth Bunker too. Otherwise, we're just pretty much trying to hold and wipe them here at this choke. Doesn't look like we're doing that great of a job, though, because the team fight is neck and neck. We are completely tied in score right now. Everyone on their team looks like they're pretty much full health here. Nobody's dying. Take that back. We had one death. Easy Bubbles almost goes down. So close. I'm going to jump down to see if I can finish it. Oh, man. I hate when that happens. You jump down to get the kill and you just don't have enough gas to finish them. They got two healers, though. Maybe they'll take out the other one. I'm staying on Easy Bubbles. There's another cheap shot. I got nothing to get out of that now. Uh, I got the Hellstone, maybe. I got my personal heal. I got wall. Didn't help, though. Still going down with the ship. Looks like we did finish wiping them for the most part, though, by the time I came back. Got to deal with a tank over here. Let's get them down. Relief Hut's got a minute and 27 left to go before it caps. Their healers just basically have fallen back here. We're taking out Fallen Days. They're by themselves now. That's all they can do is spam heal themselves. We're going to take Snowfall, of course, my home away from home. We got our base back. We got some pressure on South Bunker as well, too. Knock the Paladin out. Paladin dies to fall damage. You got to love that. <laughs> yeah, you hit your little freedom. You're going to go down here. There's nothing left for you here. You got no cooldowns. No bop, no bubble. There it is. You got your little hodge off, but I am not going to trinket that because you are dead. Let's see if we can get this graveyard. Oh, no, we can't. There's too many here. I'm in stealth. Don't break me out. <laughs> Put some pressure over here. Let's get a tap on that. Commander got broken out. I'm going to see if I can get some damage on this rogue over here. We got a tap on Storm Pike Graveyard too. Interesting enough. Hey, I'll take that kill. I'm going to try and run a little bit now. We have a tap on SHB and Icewing. Oh, no. Hodged. Drop the turtle. Use some dragon fruit there. Got back up to Snowfall. Taking out the mage next. Get this mage down. Ice block. <laughs> Wait for the block. Go ahead and cap. Cap's not going to work because the ice block's over with. 
Knocked them back pretty good. They should drop here, though. We got more than enough time to take it back. Go ahead and recap Snowfall. They have taken Stone Hearth Bunker back already. So what happens? We got more people going to Stone Earth Bunker. <laughs> I'm going to pull these guards here. See if I can fight them here. Death Tracker's going off. Got some multi-shot action with a rapid fire. Explosive shot. They're not coming after me. Very interesting there. Okay, they just kept running. I'm just going to sneak cap the graveyard. Boom, there it is. Now if we start wiping any down south, they're all going to be up north. They have a few that are coming back up here to Stone Hearth Graveyard. Our defensive team is primarily at Ice Bud Graveyard. They have three minutes to get IBT back. The graveyard's only got one minute. Always push the tower before the graveyard, though. You can always get the graveyard back. You cannot unburn the towers. There's a killing blow for me. So we're starting to push them away from this graveyard flag now. Let's go. Get Bruce Lee down. <laughs> nice little play on words there. We just got Ice Bud Graveyard back. They're hitting up IBT. We got our base back. Yep, buddy. We need more to Stone Hearth Graveyard for sure. We definitely need more here. Because they're all going to be rushing this graveyard here very soon. They're ahead in score right now. 578 to 552. We got to get IBT back. We can't give them another 100 points. We should have enough there though, I think. Problem is, I can't be every place on the map at once, you know? <laughs> I got to rely on call outs and say, hey, what do we have in there? Nice, they got it back. That is perfect. We have a minute 15 to hold this graveyard. It's going to be rough. We got the Demon Hunter down. I'm going to try and take out this Boomy next. Got a binding shot there that slows him down. I have Turtle for last resort. And I have Wall. Mage is going to go down here, maybe? Got him, yeah. <laughs> get some of them HKs. Use some explosive traps there. Knock some of them off. Try to get them away from this flag. We have a ton of people that are converging from down south. Please run past Stone Hearth Bunker and get up to this graveyard. Turtle did not help me there. And we got wiped. Lost the graveyard. Ouch. Push back again. The Alliance, they're not giving up this time. I'm going to try and take the graveyard again. They got a lot of people that are trying to fight at SHB. Oh, we got to deal with the tank now, too. Bruce Lee's up here. The tank's up here. NPCs are almost down. Maybe someone can sneak cap it. Hey, the Bud DK's dead, too, because he didn't have a chance to get any kind of runic power up, so he couldn't death strike to heal. And we got a tap on the graveyard. Tons and tons of people are going into Belinda. We got people all over the map. Looks like Alliance are going south again. They're trying to take IBT and Ice Blood Graveyard once again. This is going to be a fight to the finish, this match, man. Don't recognize too many people on their team, though, so we can't say, hey, this is a known pre-made. Huh. To be honest, man, is there anybody on their team I've seen before? I don't even know, to be honest. Not really sure. See if we can take out the Paladin. Nope, he got knocked back. Perfect. Yeah. They got a Boomy over there. Lots and lots of people are... Finished with Belinda now. That gives us a little bit of lead and score, but look at the lead. We're only leading by 38 points, which means they've outkilled us by at least 60 something. Fallen Days, take out Fallen Days, get that healer down. Healer is down. Are we just going to sacrifice IBT for Ice Wing now at this point? Nope. We're going back for it. We already got it. Now we got to check out Tower Point. We have two minutes to get it back. They have a Warlock in here, so you definitely know they're going to try and do some port action for sure. They're trying to burn West Tower. We lost Ice Wing again. We have fully capped Stone Hearth Graveyard, and we got a tap on Stone Hearth Bunker this time. Try to knock him out of here. Finish this Shaman. Shaman's dead. Loot the body. Make sure he doesn't get any reincarnation, and also loot the Warlock's body because he might have a Soul Stone. We did get TP back. Perfect. Oh, there we go. Found Teddy. Teddy's down too. Loot this body. Send him packing up north. Recall back to the base. Oh, yeah, they got several in here. Two and a half minutes to get West back. Let's see if we can get their healer down first. The healer's running out. Okay. How about Dirty Harry? No, we're not going to be able to take him out yet with the monk right here in our face. Get that rogue down, maybe. I'm putting pressure on the hunter just to kind of keep him far away. Rogue has popped Cloak of Shadows. They're going back to West Tower. I'm using all my cooldowns. Pop Turtle. Check out this Relief Hut now. 
Very nice job in our base. We already got the tower back. Now we're pushing the graveyard. We got to deal with a healer and a tank. Who? Got to take the healer out first, right? Rapid fires up. Bye bye. Loot the body before they get rebirth. Yeah. Can't rebirth now. Oh, it's on cooldown anyway for seven minutes. <laughs> you can tell you already wasted it. Nameplate cooldowns, man. It's really nice. You can see what they got, what they don't. We should be able to take out this tank, though. Tanks down. Recap the graveyard. Oh, the warrior's going to interrupt us. Oh, we just barely missed it. Now we can kill the tank. The other tank. <laughs> what do they have? Five tanks? They lost a hero, though. It seems like they only got four. We've reclaimed our base. Taking Stoneheart's bunker now. Still, though, look at that score. We've gotten 200 points extra on them, and we're only ahead by about 80 points. Whew. This has been a rough one here for sure. Lots and lots of people are still in the field. We're trying to get up here. Lock is down. Pick out with our four healers, man. At this point, drop their four healers, and we should be able to burn Icewing and get another 100 point. It's been long as hell. We're already in 30 minutes. You know what that means? That means reinforcements are starting to tick down. Every 10 seconds, both sides are losing one reinforcement. That's just the way it goes in AV. They need to implement that in ILC, to be honest. In any match where you can gain reinforcements, the reinforcements should automatically tick down after the 30-minute mark. That's just how it should be. Taking out Kitty Hills. Kitty Hills is down. It wasn't a healer, though. It was a boomy. Lots and lots of them here, right? North of Belinda. Huh. Maybe they were going to try and go south and try to hit Snowfall, but we got to wipe them next. Got taps on North and South Bunker. That's going to be fun for them. They'll have to go back and reclaim those for sure. They're still pretty strong, though. You look at these heels they got. They got some heels going off for sure. Tank is falling back. Try to take out the Powden, maybe? Powden's dead, yeah. Shammy next. Starting to wipe him here. Warriors, probably last. Demon Hunter, maybe? Nope. The tank. DK. Purgatory. Bye bye. Warrior in the back. That's a DPS arms warrior. Stay on the healer, though, right? That's what they teach you. Kill the healer. The rest of them will die. I'm trying to use Arcane Shot. Arcane Shot on the move here. That Priestess will not die. More damage, more dots, hitting them for 100,000s. It still doesn't go down. Well, take out their DPS. You get all their DPS now, and then everybody won't have any choice but to target the healer, right? Getting them down, locks down. They're starting to fall south more. Looks like we pretty much got them cleared. Hopefully they won't do too much damage if they did make it down south, but more than likely we finished wiping them there. I went back over to the choke point because they're calling people are getting through. Looks like this tank is trying to take a mage with them. Nope, not going to happen. <laughs> Free kill for me, so. Shaman's going to go down, too. Get the shaman down. Yep. Warlock next. The tank's up there, too. They got several people that are inside of Ice Wing. We just got to tap on the flag. They got to tap on IBT. Checking out IBT. Looks like the priest is running. Binding shot. That's going to stop you for a little bit. Yep. Hi. Need more damage? Not quite enough. A life cocoon. Shit. <laughs> I swear, man. These healers, it's all they do is run in packs. Wow. Got him, though. He didn't have life cocoon for himself. Looting his body. <laughs> Priest cast dome. Dome is over with now. I hit turtle by accident there. Kind of a waste. Wasted a three-minute cooldown there. Let's go up in IBT and clear him out. Got an evoker healer here, too. All their healers went on offense, so I guess we did let them go south. <laughs> sometimes that can work out for you. Sometimes not so much. At least if their healers are not in a team fight, we should be destroying them up there, right? You would think. Hunter's down. Got him. Retake IBT. Oh, going to get in. Knock him out. Oh, so close. Now we got to kill the priest. Oh, they got it right back in the priest's face anyway. <laughs> Your fear bomb was just a little bit too late. Now, as soon as the fear is gone, we can drop out of here and take him out. We got two and a half minutes to get tower point back. 
I want to get this healer out of here first. Send him packing up north. Loot all the bodies. Now they got three, four here trying to take Ice Bud Graveyard now. Is this a distraction, though? That is the question. Very well could be. If they have enough people stacking Tower Point, we are wasting time here. Looting some bodies. Make sure no rebirths are coming off. I used my personal heal there. Mage is ice blocked in the back. Gonna do some damage onto the druid while the mage is still blocked back there. Mage got a bunch of health back. Try to interrupt arcane missiles. I already did. And looks like we got them both down. Perfect. Graveyard's ours. Mage is coming back. These people are probably coming from TP. They probably should have stayed with TP, to be honest. Might be able to burn it if they had stayed. Ice Wing's burning right now. That's another 100 points for us. Yeah. Finally, we're starting to get this match under control. Jeez, Louise. Rogue's going to go ahead and vanish and pops cloak and everything. Do they have anybody up in the tower? Hunter's down. Looks like we're good. Drop the trap here. We got it. Back capped them all. We had a team that went down south and took Frostwolf. They're pushing with their entire team to the Stoneheart Graveyard now. Using Turtle right here. Paladin was wrecking face there with <laughs> the damn wings popped, right? Binding shot. Now we do some rapid fire. Lights out. Looting all the bodies. Yeah, Paladins can battle res in the Dragonflight expansion. You definitely do not want them to come back up and use their battle res on somebody else. Got another Paladin going down up there. Warlock's over here. We should have enough people here to wipe them, right? I would think. Warlock's using Dark Pact, so you got to eat through that shield first. I don't know if it's better for me to be down here or not. Yeah, I'll take that killing blow. Now we're starting to push into them. Supra's going to go down too. More killing blows. I'm still on a kill streak. I don't know how that works because I think the kill shot add-on was bugged. That's how it works. Because <laughs> I've had a couple deaths this match already. There's no way I should be on a kill streak still. And there's another death right there, see? Yeah, it was bugged. That's right. I remember this now. Kill shot had some bugs. It wasn't resetting the death counters. Take out the death knight. Yeah. What a match we had here, though. If somebody knows if there is a pre-made on the Alliance side, man, drop it down in the comments because I'd be curious to know who this was. They were definitely a formidable team. Very fun match we've got going on here. At this point, though, I think it's pretty much in our bag. We have outsmarted them in a few places. I mean, granted, like I said, they did a lot better than I thought they were going to do for sure. Finish that? Nope. Did not take out the rogue. Paladin's going to rush in. Pops wings. Get him down. Yep. The tank druid is almost dead. Paladin here bubbles and runs in. Hunter's going to go down. He's running. We're wiping him now. Another killing blow. Keep him coming. Priest, priest, priest. Yeah. Finish. Got the priest down. Tank's down there. J Turtle over here on the left. We got a Paladin that's bubbled. The Mage alters time. Shoot. I think they died through alter time, though. They did not have a chance to alter back. Now we're pushing them through the choke point. Mage Icebox in the back. Finished off the Mage after the Icebox gone. He's going to sit the full block. No, he didn't. He canceled. Boom. Now we got to deal with Boomkin. Druid is going to drop here. There's no way he survives. He pops skin and dies through. Still, right here at this choke point, this is going to be where we finish the match. I'm putting out a raid warning right now. <laughs> Let everybody know. Very nice game. Oh, for sure. Yeah. Some games like this, you know, they just kind of surprise you. They come out of nowhere. It's like, holy smokes, don't recognize anybody on the enemy team, but they're giving it their all, and we are taking it and dishing it right back, too. Got 19 points to go. Reinforcements are ticking down two every 10 seconds. Both sides lose one reinforcement. Death Knight's going to go down. And we got Kitty Hills over to the right. Goes down. Armstrong. It's not Armstrong. It's Arms Tong. <laughs> Owns the Druid. Well, let's see if we can make that one of the kills. How about the Warlock 2? No, Warlock's falling back with Dark Pact. We got a different Warlock up here. He's going to be the last kill. Lights out, man. 30 and 3, man. Not bad. I will take it. Looks like I had the top killing bulls on our team, but they did some damage and some kills on their tide, too. Look at all them heals, too. Martyr, Theo, and Beef for the top heals all over 100 million, man. May all of your random battlegrounds be epic. A thousand battles, a thousand victories. Until next time, GG.
for the horror.